Hello everybody, welcome back to more Lich Streaks. Let's roll our die. A four. Okay. I like it. I like it fine. I mean, <laughs> there's five rolls that I like. Honestly, at this point, there's, a, there's four rolls that I like. There's one that I feel guilty about and one that I don't like. And I think that, I don't know, I think over time it'll just be, uh, maybe the one role I don't like will be Bullet. Honestly, like, as crazy as that sounds, maybe that'll be the, the role I don't want because guilt. I don't know, that's just the, the way I am. Is that, is that ridiculous? That I, I would feel guilty about getting Bullet? I don't know. Anyway, this is Convict's time to show. <laughs> oh boy, all the characters are just s similar enough that it doesn't really matter. Yet it comes up every time. Check it off on the Retromation Bingo. Check off the uh, the self-referential box on the Retromation Bingo as well. Why not? Huh. Self-aware, but not enough to not talk about it. <laughs> oh boy. If this is a gun, we're not guaranteed a gun. I don't, you know, I don't even, whatever. Okay, fine. This doesn't even upset me in the way that it did pre-AG and D. Because that, you know, there's synergies with it. I know there's the KC synergy, which is honestly only okay. Um, in my opinion, I th like, I think it's fine. But it's really, like, not that good. <laughs> not that, not that special. But I'm, I'm sure there's more. I think there's one with the, uh, the hammer. Should we even be using this? Like, is it worth our time and effort? Eh. I'd say it's it's okay enough, right? It's okay enough to use it instead of our standard, our starter. Pretty sure. There's gotta be more synergies with this thing. Hammer, I'd be kinda surprised if there wasn't one. I feel like there isn't one with the wood beam, even though that would kind of make sense to me. I feel like I've had them both together and there wasn't one. Honestly, that you know what would be real cool is if with wood beam, there's just like one giant nail. <laughs> Fine. Honestly, that's like, that's a down, that's a negative thing to get ammo at this point because I feel like I should be putting it into the nail gun. But if for the wood beam, there was just like one giant nail on the tip of the wood beam, and you did extra damage if you hit with the tip of it or some a, a tipper, as they say. Who? Boy, oh boy. I know people hate on, on Fox, but just nothing's more boring than Marth to me. Sue me. Chance bullets. Now here we go. Is there a chance, b -b -b pun intended, that we could have a good gun with the nail gun nah, and chance bullets. Usually I hate chance bullets, but maybe, just maybe. High fire rate. No, not, 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 not gonna get the blunder bus. I will very likely get the barrel. I'll almost for sure get the barrel, weird. What's happening? Everyone's gone to rapture. What is it? That just shot out a nail. Chance bullets? No, 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 no. What are you doing? We're, the run is being set up to be really bad right now. I feel like... Right? Like... Can we get a beam out of this, please? It's just like... Oh... Should I get the barrel of fish? Barrel... I think we should get the barrel. I think we should do it now. Bow. Now it's gonna shoot out nails and stuff. That's the thing is we got so far, it's really set up to be, uh-oh, a pretty stinky bad run. But it is only the first floor. Should not be so quick to judge. I kind of like seeing the little beam come out. I don't know that it's gonna be better than the fish. <laughs> Gotta do it. Ah. Tried. 
But I don't know. Yeah, like, the, I like the chance to stun out of the fish, but you sacrifice that. But you know what would be good? Is if we picked up some elemental guns. I know we just rah, sacrificed the plague pistol to get the barrel. That would actually go pretty well with chance bullets. What is happening? Oh my god. It's bad. Guys, it's bad. Ew. All right, where's the freaking sewers? We need to get something else. I don't even... What is it, this room? Does the barrel work to put it out? It does. Oh my god, disgustingly bad start so far. Oh. Yuck. Yuck. In we go. The barrel is the only thing we have that's of any value. And it could probably carry us to floor three or four. But it's gonna run out of ammo. And honestly, having chance bullets is not a benefit for us right now because all of the other guns we have are bad. Ooh. There's, like, I can't remember if there's ever been a run where I have in actually had a good thing come of having chance bullets. But what would be the scenario? It would probably be, like, having a lot of uh, special effect bullets, like having flame hand, having plague pistol, all of that stuff, uh, like some kind of explosive shots, all of that, and then having like AK-47, just some crazy fast firing rate. That's, that's the situation where I could see it happening. Maybe like, I don't know if it scales with coolness, but that'd be good. Ooh, I actually have it's a mimic, but I am surprised. Oh boy. We've been getting a lot of mimics without any ranks of curse recently. Brick Breaker, that's a start. That's a start. You can start shooting out turtle bullets. In theory. I mean, we can, we can do it all the time, but... In theory, with other guns, we can shoot out turtle bullets. <laughs> okay, I like seeing the fish come out there. I don't know, it's a way that we can make, if we get some better guns, we can make our stinky guns have some value. But it's kind of like a, whoop. It's like a socialism for bullets, right? It's even, even the playing field kind of thing. Not, not meant to inc incite anything, just evens, evens out. Like the, the stronger guns get a little bit a little bit weaker, the weaker guns get a little bit stronger. All guns create a little more equal kind of thing. Whoop. Is that good for Gungeon? Maybe? But I feel like it's not. I feel like I've never had a... Never had a good situation come out of it. Whoop. What keys? Was there one for sale there? I feel like there... I feel like there was. Oh, a turtle shell! That's the... That's the ideal get. Alright, there was a key. Let's buy that. Green chest. Come on, baby. Oh. Okay. Now that's... That's worth talking about. Is it... Game changing? No. Is it worth talking about? Yes, that's why I said that to begin with. It is... It's enough to help. Especially with stinkier guns. Maybe we can use the nail gun and get some better benefits here? Oh! Turtle shell! But like, at this point, we should almost start thinking about if there's any guns we want to drop or gun munch if they you know it gets presented to us but see look at this nail gun is not that bad right now thanks to chance bullets and uh a little bit of charm rounds not so bad no more is it good no not so bad yes ah uh, you are immune to fire you st oh you stinker is that their first hit of the run what a 
bad hit. I like how the little beam from uh, Flash, Flash Ray, Flash Gun doesn't make any sound when it comes out. That's, maybe sounds like I'm not being, like I'm making fun of it, but I'm actually, I kind of like seeing it without hearing it. What do we got? What's our 3.5 curse? It's a mimic. Oh, are you kidding me? What happens? What happens? Do we get hurt? That's so stinky. It's worth it, I think, though. We, we just need to make some magic happen here, and I think that if we gotta sacrifice 3.5 curse, we gotta sacrifice 3.5 curse. Ring of the Resourceful Rat! Oh my goodness. That could be something nice. That could be something nice indeed. We gotta, we gotta think about some things here now. We can sacrifice one item every floor from here on out and get something back from the same tier. So let's see, what what tier are chance bullets? Let's look this up. We're gonna need the, the wiki on my phone now. It's B rank. B rank could be good. Like, I mean, yes, in your head you might be like, sacrifice the nail gun, it's bad. Yeah, but then we get something bad back. I'm gonna think about it. The, the good thing about the Ring of the Resourceful Rats, which is honestly like one of the items I am most excited about from AG and D, because the D6 in Isaac is real cool and real good, and it is basically that. It's, it's basically that for Gungeon, like cut and dry. Um, I'm just really excited about the prospects of it. But we gotta, we can't give up crappy items, so then we'll get crappy items back. We gotta give up, we gotta give up items that are in the wrong tier. You know, like it, items that are ranked well, but probably shouldn't be. Like what about the heart locket? Is it the heart locket? Heart locket. Cause I know one of these is, okay, so what happens if you, it says CBA. Does that mean it's a, a C tier? Does that mean if I if I try to transfer it, it gives me a C rank item? Might be worth doing. I mean, chance bullets might be worth doing as well, but I'm at this moment I'm kind of liking them. Ooh. Especially with the shotgun shooting out the fish there. Oh, that was actually just a full-on misclick. I did not, despite what it may seem, I did not feel like I was in danger in the room with no enemies. It was an actual, honest-to-goodness mis misclick. Definitely not getting rid of uh, charm rounds. I feel like that's kind of our our banger of the day so far. Not getting rid of the barrel. So dang good. Honestly, maybe undervalued. Let's go. We already bought our key, didn't we? We did. Let's do this so we don't forget. Okay. Ah. Let's fight the boss. Let's see what we get. The good thing about the resourceful round, I don't know if I said it, I think I might have cut myself off. It does actually, you keep your charges. If you don't use the charge this floor, you get to keep it for the next floor. Which is something that you wouldn't seem like it'd be true, but it is. So maybe we don't use it this floor. At the very least, I'm going to wait and see what we get for the boss. Ooh. I kind of don't want the fish to come out. Die, die. Getting hit doesn't matter that much. I'm sure we're gonna he's gonna drop health equal to whatever we would get hit by. It's kind of a nice little break for a boss to not have to carry care about that too much. Slash at all. Honestly. Let's keep on firing. Turtle shells don't go away. Okay. I kind of 
want to... I wish I could get a lot more turtle shells to come out of there. That would be... That would be the banger supreme. Can... Wait. No, no, my... Nano machine, son. God tier. Nano machines are god tier. All right, so... Unless we find the secret room. Which could be off the side here somewhere. Not gonna look too hard. It's not off the bottom or top here, is it? I feel like we would have seen that. Did we already find it? I don't think so. Okay, my only guesses at this point are off of off the side here. Off the side here. I know, use the shotgun. Bada 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 bada. But I think I'm just gonna throw up blank in here. Boom. Snowballer and fifty shells! Snowballer! It's definitely not a not a trade scenario. 50 casings. My word. That's a bummer. All right. We definitely left this floor in a great spot compared to when we got in there. We went in a boy. We came out a man. All right. Yeah. Now I'm super confused about what to do. I'm thinking we're going to... Let's do chance points. It screwed me over too many a time. It's just not going to be worth it. I'd, I'd much rather have all of my shots be turtle shells at this point. Maybe he'll end up giving us crap. But I... Th you know what? I like the drum clip. I Is it the same tier? I didn't think so. Is drum clip really B tier? Drum clip is B tier. Hmm. I mean, I like it. Nothing wrong with it. I definitely consider it to be more reliably effective than chance bullets. Oh! Thought I froze you. Really liking the charm rounds. Ooh, mixed here with the uh, whole the ice. We can try to get them to be in love with us by the time they thaw out. I mean, but at the same time, they're frozen for the entire time they're in love with us. Are they ever really in love with us? Ah, you're gonna come after me. I know that. Ooh. All right, I'm, I'm liking where this run is going now. I feel I feel good about it. Oh. So do we have anything else we want to trade? Not trading nano machines. That's like my prized possession here. I, I'm tempted to trade the health upgrade. That man is frozen on the edge. But if it is just going to give me a C tier item, that doesn't seem very like a very smart trade. If it could give me an A tier, oh boy. Oh boy. I definitely would. Snowballer's super good. Definitely, like, it was under tiered. I think it I think they buffed it. I think it's I think it's higher rated now. It's just so good. Like the damage it does is seems too high for how good of a utility it has. Oh man. You are in love, you are in love. Mind the snowballs.
Yes, it does matter which gun you're holding. I have to say that every time. Why did I buy heavy boots? You may ask. Because I am sick of getting alien engine and not having heavy boots. It happens every time I see heavy boots and pass it up, alien engine shows up on like the forge. Thus screwing me out of one of the strongest soft synergies in the entire game. One up. Probably not the strongest, but just like the, the damage that alien engine does if you don't get moved is ridiculous. But I mean, heavy bullets, it's a, um, it's a synergy magnet. I, I've done my duty with nail gun. If we miss out on a synergy, bummer. Every time. Every time. I'm so annoyed with seeing this dang gun. It seems like it's the only thing I get out of there. Is there a key for sale? So what you got? Ah! Oh! Fair enough, I mean, I guess, whatever, that makes sense. What tier is the gas mask, I wonder? What is that? C tier, 42 shells? It's based off, the, the price is based off the tier. So I think that's the, uh, oh. oh my goodness, I just realized. We should be able to keep him chilled so much better because Litchi Trigger Finger increases your fire rate, thus increasing the uh, rate of freeze. Oh! Soft Synergy Supreme! Oh no, I didn't! No! <laughs> didn't know you weren't gonna be frozen. That's a bummer. There goes the health upgrade. God, it's so noticeable, the fire rate up. Do we have two fire rate ups? Or is Lichy Trigger Finger just that good? Bye, boy. Hmm. What tier is this? A tier. You know what? Okay, I'm gonna go to the next floor because I'm afraid that I've been lied to. I'm afraid that you guys don't know what you're talking about and it doesn't reserve. But I'm, I feel like that is true. I feel like I have tried it before. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna try my luck. Do I like chaos bullets? Yes, I like them fine. Do I think they're the in the top 50% of A tier passives? I don't. Do I think that Crisis Stone is? No, probably not either. Wait, I thought it does it not work every time. I'm confused. I thought it was supposed to make me invincible when I reload. Does it not work? Am I missing something? I'm getting a one-way ticket to Rerollsville. I'm really, really hoping that you guys are telling the truth. Oh, baby. That is potentially a run changer if we get a nice space bar item. Whew. Is Molotov the best for uh, blank painting? Nah, not necessarily. Is it okay? Yes, it is okay. Doesn't take as long to charge up as some of the other ones. Was that worth it to, to go through all that to, to get it? Maybe not. Oh. 
but I'm feeling strong. Hey, hey. Well, okay, so there's the shut. What is this room? What is this room? I don't know that I've seen this one before. It's like so, so weirdly tall. Like magic bullets. Oh. <laughs> uh, uh, no. Ah, that doesn't work at all. Uh oh. It pushed him out of the way of the Molotov. Okay. That's worth considering. So maybe it is a bad combo. What do we want to fill? Honestly. Give me some of that. Magic bullets. Do I want magic bullets? I, I might. For 91. That might not be too bad. Might gun munch. Holy moly. Am I missing something? Is this only from Lichy Trigger Finger? That seems so good. Another gun where the fast fire rate should mean a pretty ridiculous increase in uh, effectiveness because we should be able to stun more quickly. Uh oh. Oh. Easy enough. Okay. Kind of surprised there's no Winchester Winchester rifle synergy. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do I want to keep this? I don't know. Let's. Oh, let's use it up for a little while. Then at least if we want to gun munch it, we can justify it. Maybe if we munch the Winchester and the Winchester's rifle, something magical will happen. Huh. Didn't have my Molotov blank up yet. Where are you? Sir? Okay, that's full. Okay. Just because I feel like I have to complete the map, there's that. There's a key for sale, but then we can't get the magic. What is it, a green chest, though? I... We'll see. Uh-oh. I should probably save my Molotov just, like, as a blank. Truly. Uh-oh. I'm scared that this slow-mo is actually gonna make things harder. Okay, nope. So far, so good there. Uh-oh. Um? He's slowly speeding back up. <laughs> We're not doing a lot of damage. Didn't really like that there. Danger! I, I kind of regret what I'm doing. Okay, well, we could have Molotov. Which is my blank, effectively. That's all I got now. Ooh. Ooh. I mean, I could use it to actually get some extra DPS with some... Ooh, fire. You know... Use it how caliber intended. Ah, I thought I was doing it perfect. But we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. And we get the perfect. Bada bing, bada boom. Heck. Blaster. With the drum clip synergy. Is it good?
I have no idea. It, so what does the synergy do, you may wonder? I have had it before. It slowly recharges the ammo. Look in the bottom right. Bip. <laughs> Bip. <laughs> That's all it does. So it kind of makes it like an infinite ammo gun, but not really. It de-jams enemies. It does that. It does that all the time because that's just what Heck Blaster does. Like here, we can even de-jam this man. I think. Yep. Which is pretty cool. You don't usually get to see that guy de-jammed. So it's nice to have as just like a secondary gun. Is it crazy good? I don't know. Is there some tech there? Yeah, for sure. You can use it effectively. There's a use for it. It's definitely not useless. How good it is depends on probably like how how cursed you are. Like if you've got a pretty dang cursed run, you, like a lot of curse, and you, you know, aren't able to take advantage of your damage because they got the extra health, there you go. Like super, super spiced run plus heck blaster. That's a good run. Hoo, hoo. A barrel plus Litchi trigger finger. That alone is really speaking to me right now. I'm, I'm feeling super good about it. Like I, I would do it till I die if I could. Bup, 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 bup. Like, I started off definitely not feeling confident about this run. I'm feeling pretty good about it right now. I feel like the sewer changed everything for me. I've never been the same man since I went to the sewers. Mm -hmm. Okay. Blank Companion's Ring makes that not a bad idea. Normally, I think it's a little spendy. Blank Companion's Ring makes it so we can actually get a decent amount of DPS out of pressing space at this point. Like, we should be able to, in theory, one-shot most basic enemies, I think, with the blank damage up. Especially paired with a little bit of Molotov. A little bit of Molotov. Ooh, on the floor. Weep. Little bit of barrel full of fish. Does the song make sense? No, it don't. Really not the gun to use, but all guns feel super strong with Litchy Trigger Finger just because they fire fast. Look, the thing to think about, though, is you are ripping through your ammo faster, so you have to aim well. Otherwise, you gain nothing. I did that for a shield. That is ironic. Seeing as I lost one. Oh, maybe two. Switch guns, you doink. Why? I'm playing playing like crazy here. Okay, so we got a key. That's nice, at least. Give me something. Good. Okay. Bum bullets. Not bad. Inherently better than uh, something like... Which does remind me, we do have the ability to reroll. Is there anything worth rerolling that we have? You can maybe argue Heck Blaster might be a good reroll. Right? What what tier is it? Is it A tier? A A tier? It is B tier. Okay, probably not worth like rerolling. Cause I, I I think I appreciate it as much as a B tier gun can be appreciated. You never munched anything on the last floor. It'd probably be a good idea to munch nano machines on bullet hell. Those are a B tier? Those are B tier? Are you kidding me? That is such value. To get that early on? Nano machines are B tier. That's wild to me. 
They're so game changing if you get them early on. They're B tier if you get them on, like if I got them right now or got them on Forge or something. They're probably like a C tier on Bullet Hell. Oh, uh, we're out of fish. Snowball? Does it work? It does. Haven't found the shop yet. Have we? No. Like some, uh, well, like the ability to pay for some keys. But you know what? Full Metal Jacket might not be too bad. With our, uh, ooh, woo. With our gold amulet. Frost amulet might not be a bad, bad choice either. They kind of do stack on themselves a little bit. No, I mean not literally, like in a in a soft synergy kind of a way, because you get you get more blanks, therefore you get to use them more. So it is it's like a soft synergy, not to be confused with soft serve. I don't want to deal with this room. We kind of have like our own baby bracket key. Proximity mine. The proximity mine. How long do you take to charge? Does it say recharge? Does it? Wait. Does it change? 300 damage on floor one to charge. I don't know. That's... Seems like it's a lot. It's twice as fast as the Molotov. Tell you what we do. Take it, sir. Take it, Sir Raddington. The decoy. How long does the decoy take to charge? Because if it takes the same amount, I would prefer that. 400. I'll go with the decoy. That's a faster charge. Well, should we give it a go? Madman! Alright, and I think that I'm more likely to get a better item from this than the blue chest. So I'd rather go for... Mad gun. Eh, I don't know. I like. I feel like I should like it, but ever since they made it so the damage goes away when you switch guns, not liked it nearly as much. Uh, yeah. All right. Ooh. Should probably use this as an actual blockade. There we go. We got some decent damage. Bada bing. Super easy. Oh my goodness. Hyper Light Blaster. Now that's a banger. Did you take... Okay, so he officially took it, so we are, we are out of charges. It's nice to actually know that officially, too. Well, glad I wasn't standing by that. All right, so now we do have the ability to steal from the blacksmith, too. What would that put us at, though? Like, we don't have any cursed items. No. So we have two ranks of curse from stealing... 3.5 from taking the mirror item. 5.5 ain't too nasty. Plus, we got the Heck Blaster to balance it out if we so need. Oh, what have I done? 
That was real risky. Okay. I'm liking this. What? Did I severely do my math wrong? Did I severely do my math wrong, or was that a guy spawning in the room as it was over? Seems like it might have just been the latter. All right. Good, good. So I want to steal from the blacksmith. Ah, uh, another one bites the dust. Uh, sure, I'll steal from me. I'll steal that irradiated lead. <laughs> Probably worth it, right? Ah, keep on missing. Fish, 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 fish. Where's the hyperlight fisher? Honestly. Barrel is one of my favorite guns in the game. <laughs> like, is that is that wild to say? There's just something about Barrel and Anvil and recently have been speaking to me as masters of their tier. Like, better than they have any right to be, effectively. Okay. Bad boy. Can't aim for crap. Should maybe put out the heck blasters are secondary. Oh, it rolled into it. Is that a good idea? Maybe not, because I do want to steal, but don't really care about the pitchfork, and we'll probably get enough money to steal anyways. So honestly, who knows? Maybe it doesn't really matter. Maybe we don't want to steal. Maybe it's not worth the curse. Decoy is so good, too. I always sleep on the fact that it's just... Not only is it good to steal with, it's actually a good item. Actual retching. No good. Hello! B. Oh, he's not ready for that. Sir Manuel. Why you even bother? Oh, he almost got me good. He's taking longer to kill than like the past five times that I fought him. Fight. Dead in a pile of fish. Okay, well that was a very bummer payout. Yeah, we're gonna get enough money to just buy a radiated lead. Should we maybe just do that? Like, is Pitchfork even... I don't know that there's anything else worth buying in there. What else was for sale? Is that, yeah, I don't really... Like, Pitchfork is fine. But I don't know that I care about it that much. So maybe we'll just not get cursed more than we need to. Honestly, sure. I would like another key to get that, but it won't be that big of a deal. There's something to be said about 
angry bullets and hyper light. No, there's not. They don't function together. That's right. You would think they would, but they don't. It just consumes the bullet. So never mind. But we don't really have that many piercing items of note. Like, the Brick Breaker won't be hurt that much by Angry Bullets. I think we actually have a pretty optimal... Actually, there's no real point. That... Kind of lame. To get on the Forge. Yeah, I mean... Okay, ah, we have an optimal Angry Bullets setup right now. Nothing really bad with Angry Bullets. No soft disenergies. You dead son. Ah. Okay, there goes all the shields. Right, wait, we got another one. Thank you, nano machines. What? What? Get out of here! Ya punk? Ya punk? P O N K punk. Angry bullets barrel? Is there anything you can't do? You little gun? You little sun and a gun? Yeah, we don't need to mess with <laughs> the uh, vampire at all. I don't know that angry bullets are bad or good with this, necessarily. Oh, you know what? Maybe we can be pretty loose with our blanks. And our sp we should be more loose with our space bar, but... Huh. Is he hitting the yeah, he's in the decoy. You're a lunatic. Easy as hell. Okay. Bad. Bad boy. Oh, dumb. Ah, you gotta be kidding me. Were we like one, one fish short of a fry? One fish short of a fish fry. Is that offensive? Look at that one fish sitting up there in the hallway. Okay. I mean, is there anything worth Oh, oh, the hack. Quote unquote. We didn't do it on this floor, did we? Wait, oh, you can't drop it like this. You have to let the rat take it there. Oh, that sucks. I thought you could. Fair enough. Oop. Bad boy. Now I know. I've never... St stop talking. Stop. 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 Hmm. Well. Yeah, I thought I could take the bullet that can kill the past. Can we drop this? No. So I guess it can take the bullet that can kill the past, but you gotta leave it there. What about the master round? What What's here is a master round. Let's see. Master round doesn't have a quality. 
What about the bullet that can kill the pass? The bullet that can kill the pass doesn't have a quality either. Let's see if the rat can take it. For the sake of science. Alright. Okay, fair enough. So we probably missed out on something good with the bullet and kill the past. If that's even true, I don't know. I've never... I've never had experience with it being true or not. But people say that you can... The rat can take the bullet that can kill the past and it gives you an S tier item, but... The wiki says it doesn't have a quality. So I don't know. So who's lying to me? Is there something like at this point I'm like, okay, now maybe it makes sense to drop nano machines. That's a B tier. Let's just let's let's play around a little bit longer. Maybe we'll run out of ammo for something of note when we get to the fight, and then we, at that point, we would just as well, um, oop, drop it. Like, the barrel's great, but if we don't have any ammo in it when we get to the Lich, we might as well cash it in for something else. You hear what I'm saying? Picking up what I'm putting down? Same with Hyper Light Blaster. It's a banger supreme, but without ammo, it is not. <laughs> Okay, and in rooms with lots of enemies, I think that maybe angry bullets are a benefit. There. I thought that piercing would be better, but maybe not. Huh? Oh. We have four blanks. We should have stolen the blank, the uh, amulet. Oh well. Is it gonna make that big of a difference? No, probably not. Could have stolen Full Metal Jacket, traded for something else. I wasn't really thinking about it, because honestly, it is a one run, for sure. I will be bamboozled, bamboozled, if it's not. Sling, okay. I'll be so sad. If this is a law set this right. Is that not reaching him? Have fish and lasers. Yeah, we definitely picked the correct general direction. What is this, another... Nope. Thought it would be another split off in multiple directions. Honestly, I typically get hit in this room, so... If I don't have to deal with it, that's... I'm angry! Then I'm, <laughs> then I'm good with that. Whatever. Punks. The rad gun. That's that's what I'm gonna get rid of, honestly. Rad gun rad gun's for punks. Change my mind. I like the idea of rad gun, I just I think in practice it just doesn't hold up. You can have it. Dang it. Now we gotta go two rooms away. 
sit for a little bit. Am I wrong? I thought that's how it works. Oh, wait, it does. Yeah, there we go. Boys and girls. That's whoop, probably the single greatest trade oh, that I could have made. Yeah. Banger Supreme. I love the gun zang. It's so satisfying to use. Oh. Alright. Alright. Not, not that many jammed enemies, considering. Poison and bees, poison and bees. Wow. I shoot. Wasn't able to drop the decoy fast enough there. I'm having a lot of fun with Gunzang. Gunzang, so much better, wow, for me than Radgun. Better in general? Mm, arguable. Better for me? Practically inarguable. Practically. Get good, you might say. Yeah, I agree. Whoop. But I think that there's a certain level that, like, without something like Super Hot Watch. Obviously, Rad Gun is so supreme in that scenario. Obviously, it's amazing. Ooh, baby. Got the trifecta. <gasps> bada bing, bada boom. Do you have another synergy with it, too? Nope. Um. Alright. Did I miss? Did we hit the decoy just to... There? No. This is easy, ween. This is easy, ween. <laughs> ah, nice aiming! Chump! Easy, ween. Easy, ween. Let's right in the middle there. Do a little wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. For a nice, clean 19 streak, I'm, I'm saying, right? I don't want to. I should have saved that. I don't trust it. I don't trust the decoy. I'm trusting you here, though. Okay. This is ridiculous how easy this is. This is ridiculous. Super dang easy. Did that just eat my bullets? I think that just ate my bullets. Huh. Much harder to uh, hyperlight blast this boy than anywhere else. Everything! Yeah! Whoop! <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> okay. 
Is he on Primifier? No, he's not. Bye bye Honk! So there we go. And so it was that Retro Nation had a streak of 19. And he was happy. But not as happy as he'll be if he can make a streak of 20. That's a that's a number. That's a <laughs> unlike 19. <laughs> 20 is a number. Now 20 it's a it's a fun number. Any multiple of 10 just feels like a more exciting number. Even though it's all arbitrary. But we're every every win we get here is just another another notch on our highest streak we've ever had, or at least that we paid attention to. So Bada bing bada boom. I am pleased indeed. But anyway, that is gonna do it. Ring of the Resourceful Rat, God Among Men. Jeez Louise. Anyway, yeah, uh, join my Discord. If you have things you wanna wanna say to me, suggestions for the Gungeon series, mod the Gungeon or regular Gungeon or whatever the hell, or if you just wanna talk about Gungeon. I, uh, also, I'm gonna be streaming soon. I'm gonna start start getting back into it. I've done it a little bit. Twitch.tv slash Retromation. Go check that out. It's gonna be sporadic, so you're gonna wanna be followed if you want to see it. Because otherwise, you will very likely miss it. It's gonna be very sporadic to start out with. But that is gonna do it for today. Thank you for watching. Thank you, thank you. See you next time.